Welcome to this tutorial. Uh, in this tutorial, we are seeing linked lists and we'll be coding in Java. So first, let's see what exactly a linked list. According to Geeks for Geeks, it's basically a list of connected nodes, each node having two parts. One is the data part where you can store your integer value or character or text, whatever you want. And the other part of the node is the uh, point location to the next node. The first node, the starting node is called the head node and the end node is an empty one. So this is basically a single linked list. So let's get uh, get down to coding and coding this in Eclipse. So let me create a new Java project. Let's call this linked list. Uh, we'll wait for it to build paths. Okay, now we go over here, Cl right click on source create a new class let's call it linked list okay so basically uh, we we can create a new another class as well let's right click over here and create a new class and let's call this class as node so what a node will have is basically it will contain a pointer to the next node. Uh, we'll, we'll be storing integer type data in this. And then we write public. We need a small p for this. Public node. Uh, input would be value. And this dot data will be equal to value. And this dot next we define it equal to null okay so the definition for node is done now we come to this uh, for linked list what we first do is create we create a head node which would be global then we create different functions uh, first function being an insert function so insert will take an input data let's call it x then we say if head is null head is equal to a new node new node and the value we give it is x uh, this should be public okay and if it is not null then we first create a temporary node which is equal to head we do this in order to not lose our head node then we say while temp dot next not equal to null so till we find an empty node we keep on moving forward temp is equal to temp dot next and once we're done with this we say temp dot next now once we have found an empty node we declare it equal to a new node with input x input x okay so we're done with the insert function uh, then we can create a print list function so public void print list there won't be any input arguments for this one uh, we create a temporary node again not to lose our head node uh, then we say while temp not equal to null we print system dot out dot print temp dot data and we can input this as well system dot out dot print to give spacing between each printed node we put this okay and once we printed this we want to move to the next node so we say temp is equal to temp 
temp dot next pretty cool and then once we're done printing all the nodes we do want to print our last node which is basically null so we say system dot doubt dot print null okay uh, now we can create a function which will basically give us the head of the node of the list so let's call it public void get head again we don't need to give any input for this uh, this basically system dot out dot print line uh, just give us the head dot data okay and then we have our main function public static word main string arguments uh, let's create a new instance of our linked list class let's call it list new linked list Uh, then we insert some random numbers into this list dot insert let's say five let's copy this control c control v make this two okay so let's make this minus two ten and one and then we simply print our list so list dot print list and we can do one more thing list okay just let, let's just first run this much and see if it actually works okay so it gives 5 to minus 2 10 1 and null pretty cool our code seems to be working fine over here uh, we can get the head of the list by saying list dot get head uh, Let's run this so it should give us five. Okay, it gives five, but uh, Let's say after now we give a new line now. Let's run this. Okay, so head it's giving us five list is getting printed last node is null head node is five seems to be working pretty fine if you have any queries write down in the comment section make sure to like the video if you did like it subscribe thanks for watching keep watching peace